Tonight is Tuesday, April 25th, and I'm making mom's pan fried burgers and fries. And I'm gonna use one of those wonderful turkey patties that I froze the other day. I'm gonna cook it in my cast iron, spray it with a little bit of oil. Now this puppy's gonna sizzle. Nice. I like to use a cast iron skillet to add just a little bit of iron in our food. I am also deep frying some fries. I'm gonna have a little bit and the boys will have more than me, but I'm gonna have the cauliflower and then I'll have 48 grams of this. And I just use this thing to chop them. It's pretty handy. I'm also going to chop up these mushrooms and saute them a little bit and a little bit of onion. I'm also going to dip my fries in cauliflower. Three tablespoons for two smart points of this Tostitos cheese. I love this cheese with broccoli, with so many things. It's so delicious and it's not too bad in points. I mean, three tablespoons for two smart points. So I like to keep a bag of this frozen cauliflower in my freezer because it's just nice to have in case I forget to order that vegetable or the vegetable expires or something like that. It's just great because it's easy, convenient. So I just throw it on a cookie sheet, some parchment paper, spray a little bit of spray on it, add a little bit of salt, and roast it in the oven for about 20, 25 minutes. It's a zero point side and it's 98 cents for this little bag. So I think it's a pretty perfect side. I keep these in the freezer and just defrost out one bun the night before. These are keto culture buns and they are two smart points each. This is a frozen one, it's smushed, but I mean, they're really great buns for two points. I like them. I'm going to use one slice of Velveeta cheese for my burger for one point. And I've added the boys Wagyu burgers and I'm just gonna add a little garlic salt because you know, this is having a family. They don't want the turkey burger. I'm fine with the turkey burger. I feel like I'm included and it's okay. I'm happy with it. And I feel very full after and, and then I'm losing weight. So my husband likes, he likes cayenne pepper a lot. So I put that on his burger. Okay. We're continuing to cook. How, how are you guys doing? Ooh, they look nice. I'm gonna add a little salt. I've added my onion and sliced mushroom to the pan. I just have to watch so that that oil doesn't get onto my burger and my vegetables that I'm sauteing, but I'll do my best. Sliced up the vegetables for the burgers. The turkey patty looks like it turned out pretty good. That's my onions and mushrooms. I did put them in between some paper towels and try to squeeze out the excess oil. I'm not going to count the oil because let's. I'm just not trying to be that ridiculous. And then there's my son's um, hamburger patty. He says he really likes my hamburgers because they're so delicious and dry. So I heated the cheese up in the microwave and I measured myself out three tablespoons. It's a good amount. It looks like it's a small amount here, but it's it's decent. Fries are done. That's a lot of fries. I don't know what I was thinking. Cauliflower roasted so nicely. So there's my wonderful turkey burger. And I've used about half of my cauliflower. Now I'm going to weigh out 48 grams of these fries. Close enough. Um, there, I spread them out. It looks like a decent amount. And I have the cauliflower and I have that burger, so that's the meal.